The tragic death of 25-year-old Garrison Brown has shocked the Sister Wives universe. Hello guides, I am Sabrina. To you, welcome back to my channel. Please subscribe the channel and press bell icon for latest news updates. Robin Brown may regret pushing the other wives away, affecting her relationship with Cody. The Browns need each other now more than ever amid existing resentments and rifts. Robin Brown may feel the price of fame is too high as internet cruelty worsens post-tragedy. The shock over the tragic death of Garrison Brown continues to reverberate through the Sister Wives universe, and Robin Brown will never be the same. When the series first premiered in 2010, Cody was married to his first three wives, Mary Brown, Janelle Brown, and Christine Brown. Cody, his three wives, and their 12 children all lived in one large house in Utah, with each wife having her own wing where she lived with her children. Everything changed when Cody moved the Brown family out of Utah and to Arizona, in fear that the state would prosecute him for polygamy. During Sister Wives Season 1, Cody married his fourth wife, Robin, and moved the Brown family out of Utah and into four separate homes in Las Vegas. This divided the family and Cody's time, leaving less time for each of his wives and children. COVID-19 divided the family even further, exposing the existing resentments and rifts within the family. In stark contrast to the first season, Sister Wives season 18 found Cody divorced from his first three wives and in a monogamous relationship with Robin. Despite their issues, Robin loves Garrison and is devastated by his death. Robin Brown may regret pushing the other wives away. The Browns need each other right now. During Sister Wives Season 1, the Browns were planning Cody's wedding to Robin, so Robin and her sister wives went wedding dress shopping. They had a lovely afternoon together and bonded. Mary, Christine, and Janelle were so moved that Robin wanted them involved in her special day. However, Cody ruined the bonding moment when he revealed he had gone back to the bridal shop with Robin and selected her dress himself. This was the perfect encapsulation of the way Robin pushed Cody's other wives away over the years since marrying Cody and joining their family. Over the years, Robin has destroyed her relationship with Christine and Janelle. Robin had Mary for a while, but Mary finally got the confidence to leave Cody. Now Robin, who joined the Brown family in large part because she wanted the full plural family experience, is stuck in an accidentally monogamous relationship with Cody. In the devastating aftermath of Garrison's tragic death, Robin probably wishes she could mourn with the rest of the Brown clan instead of being isolated from most of the family. Robin Brown may find that the price of fame is too high. The internet can be so cruel. Robin was driven off social media by mean comments, but that hasn't stopped some Sister Wives fans from continuing to go after Robin on old Instagram posts. Cody's fourth wife has often drawn the wrath of fans who have blamed her for bringing about the demise of the Brown family. Robin's Instagram comment section has always been a dumpster fire, but things have become worse since Garrison's death. Fans have taken to Robin's old Instagram posts to blame her for Garrison's death, which is unfair in addition to being unkind. Fans of Sister Wives need to remember that Robin is grieving a profound loss and deserves grace. Regardless of how people feel about her behavior, and despite their problems over the years, Robin loved Garrison. During one episode of Sister Wives Season 11, Garrison is seen coming home from being away with the National Guard and is welcomed home by his family. In the above clip, Robin is one of the first people to enthusiastically welcome Garrison home and her love for him is easy to see. Robin Brown might miss the exes. She's stuck with Cody. Robin may have thought she wanted Cody all to herself, but now that she has found herself in a monogamous relationship with him, it may not be what she thought it would be. Cody is moody and has always needed an enormous amount of attention. Four women struggle to manage Cody's emotional needs. Now it's all on Robin, and especially with Cody grieving, she may want the support system she used to be able to rely on before the other wives left. Though they had problems, she may prefer that to being alone with Cody. Robin Brown may feel depressed. These are dark times for the family. Robin married into the Brown family in 2010, so she has known Garrison for most of his life. She watched him grow up alongside her own children and always had a warm relationship with him. Like the rest of the Brown family, Robin is undoubtedly devastated by Garrison's death. The last few years have been especially difficult for the Browns, 
with COVID-19 dividing the family and three consecutive divorces tearing the family apart. The last few years have likely taken a toll on Robin and her mental health. When Robin first joined the Brown family, she had envisioned she would be happy with Cody and her sister wives for the rest of her life. She had dreamed of her children growing up alongside their many siblings, always surrounded by love and support. Now, Robin's dream has been shattered, and Robin likely wishes she could turn back time and do things differently. These feelings of depression and regret may affect Robin's relationship with Cody one day in the future. However, Sister Wives Robert Garrison Brown memorialized by local animal shelter nearly three weeks after death. Sister Wives star Robert Garrison Brown was memorialized by High Country Humane Society in Flagstaff, Arizona, nearly three weeks after he died from an apparent suicide. Today, we honor Robert Garrison Brown for his love and compassion towards cats and all animals by naming our cat adoption room after him and the cats he loved and adopted from us. The animal shelter wrote via Instagram on March 23. Garrison, your memory has touched so many lives already and will continue to do so here at High Country Humane for years to come. The statement concluded, Thank you for sharing your passion for animals with us. We will remember you always. In addition to the touching caption, the post also included a snapshot of a framed photograph of Garrison holding one of his cats that was put up in the shelter. A following video showed one of the shelter's employees explaining that they raised $25,000 in Garrison's honor in the two weeks following his death on March 5. It's an amazing gift in his memory and it's a true testament to the person he was, the employee explained in the clip. He was passionate about senior cats, and the words that people wrote in their donations were just incredibly inspiring and some of them didn't know him outside of the Sister Wives program. Garrison's mother, Janelle Brown, later took to her Instagram stories to reshare the video with her followers on March 24, just hours after news broke that Garrison had died from a self-inflicted gunshot wound at the age of 25. Janelle, 54, and Cody Brown confirmed their son's death in a joint statement. Cody and I are deeply saddened to announce the loss of our beautiful boy Robert Garrison Brown, she wrote via Instagram. He was a bright spot in the lives of all who knew him. His loss will leave such a big hole in our lives that it takes our breath away. We ask that you please respect our privacy and join us in honoring his memory. Garrison was an outspoken lover of cats, which prompted many TLC fans to donate to High Country Humane Society in his honor. It has been heartwarming to see the donations in his name that continue to pour in. The shelter wrote via Instagram on March 13, which Janelle reshared on her own page. Donations are total that nearly 13 can growing thanks to your support. The animal shelter explained that Garrison's unwavering love for cats was a heartfelt passion, revealing that they named their cat adoption room in his honor. Garrison's legacy is one of compassion, laughter, and unconditional love. The caption continued. His spirit lives on in every meow, in every cozy lap nap, and in the purring contentment of the cats he adored. Garrison showed us the purest form of love, teaching us that every cat deserves a chance at a loving home. However, before Garrison Brown's tragic death, he had been struggling with his mental health and addiction. He was having a hard time before his death. Garrison Brown missed the way the Brown family used to be, longing for the good old days. Garrison Brown allegedly struggled with alcohol addiction and depression, drinking almost every night. Garrison Brown had issues with his ex-girlfriend and felt pressure from social media, never feeling good enough. The reality TV world was shaken this month by the tragic, untimely death of 25-year-old Sister Wives star Garrison Brown, who had been struggling with some personal issues before his passing. Garrison was found dead in his Flagstaff, Arizona, home with a self-inflicted gunshot wound. He was found by his younger brother, Gabriel Brown, who had volunteered to check in on him. The young National Guard member and student leads behind his father, four mothers and 17 brothers and sisters. When Sister Wives first premiered in 2010, the large Brown family lived in one large house in Utah, with all the siblings growing up together. This was when the family was at its happiest, including Garrison. After Cody married his fourth wife, Robin Brown, and moved his family out of Utah, the family began to crumble. Making matters worse, the arrival of the COVID-19 pandemic further divided the family, 
by 2023, three of Cody's four wives have left him, and many of his children rarely see him anymore. Garrison Brown missed the way the Brown family used to be, the good old days. According to Garrison's mother, Janelle Brown, told police that her son had sent a text before he died that read, I want to hate you for sharing the good times, but I can't. I miss these days. There's been a lot of online speculation about what this message could have meant. It's possible the message was referencing the good days when his family was still together. Ever since Cody married his favorite wife, Robin, during Sister Wives season one, he spent less and less time with his older children, and Garrison has felt resentful because of it. Addison stated that he has had conversations with Garrison about him being depressed lately. He stated that Garrison is an alcoholic and drinks every night. Garrison Brown allegedly had issues with alcohol. He struggled with addiction. According to The Sun, which obtained a copy of the police report, Garrison's roommates told police he had a serious drinking problem and that he drank on most nights and he appeared to be intoxicated the night he passed away. The roommates, identified as Addison, Cheyenne, and Tyler, also told police that the Sister Wives star had spoken to all three of them about his struggles with depression. The officer wrote, Addison stated that he has had conversations with Garrison about him being depressed lately. The report went on to say, he stated that Garrison is an alcoholic and drinks every night. Garrison Brown had issues with his ex. He had a broken heart. According to the same police report, all three of Garrison's roommates also told officers that the Sister Wives star and National Guard member told them that he had been having issues with one of his ex-girlfriends. The report went on to say that Addison stated that he knew that Garrison was having problems with his ex-girlfriend and that he was not a very happy person. Cheyenne corroborated Addison's claim. She stated that she talked a little more in-depth with him about how he was struggling with drinking and his depression surrounding that, the police statement read. And I don't think we do enough to bring awareness. It wasn't bullying. It wasn't a lack of love that Garrison had. It was mental health. And I am going to continue talking about mental health and self-care until I am blue in the face. Garrison Brown felt pressure due to social media. He never felt good enough. In an Instagram post following Garrison's death, his sister, Madison Brown revealed that social media pressure may have contributed to her brother's feelings of inadequacy. Madison believed Garrison's struggles were exacerbated by social media, which made him feel like he wasn't doing enough. Despite all he accomplished, he never felt good enough. And I don't think we do enough to bring awareness. It wasn't bullying. It wasn't a lack of love that Garrison had, it was mental health, Madison said. And I am going to continue talking about mental health and self-care until I am blue in the face, he added. Two weeks ago, on Tuesday, March 5, my older brother Garrison took his own life. He was 25. I'm having a hard time understanding it. But I know now, more than anything, that my brother Garrison is no longer in any more pain. Garrison Brown was reportedly depressed. He was in a dark place. Several of Garrison's siblings have addressed the Sister Wives star's mental health before his tragic death. On March 18, Garrison's sister, Savannah Brown, posted several photos of her brother to Instagram, including a photo of a young Garrison holding baby Savannah during happier times for the Brown family. Her caption read, two weeks ago, on Tuesday, March 5, my older brother Garrison took his own life. He was 25. I'm having a hard time understanding it. She went on to say, but I know now, more than anything, that my brother Garrison is no longer in any more pain. However, Animal Shelter honors late sister wives star Garrison Brown following flood of donations. When a young person dies by suicide, there are often so many unanswered questions. A hole is left behind in both the family and the surrounding community as they mourn a life lost far too soon. And when that person happens to be a celebrity, the effects of the death ripple even wider. This is exactly what happened when Robert Garrison Brown, the son of Sister Wives stars Janelle Brown and Cody Brown, died on March 5. His cause of death was an apparent self-inflicted gunshot wound. A local animal shelter, however, has honored Garrison in a special way following a slew of donations in his name. A Flagstaff, Arizona, Animal Rescue dedicated a room to Garrison. High Country Humane in Flagstaff, Arizona, made a special announcement March 23. 
Today, we honor Robert Garrison Brown for his love and compassion towards cats and all animals by naming our cat adoption room after him and the cats he loved and adopted from us, the animal shelter wrote on Instagram. The message continued, Garrison, your memory has touched so many lives already and will continue to do so here at High Country Humane for years to come. Thank you for sharing your passion for animals with us, we will remember you always. More than $25,000 was raised in Garrison's name. The money came in via more than 1,000 donors in just two weeks. It's an amazing gift in his memory, and it's a true testament to the person he was. Jane Horton, development director for the Animal Shelter, said in a video shared via Instagram, and he was passionate about senior cats, and he actually adopted three from High Country Humane. Sister Wives fans reacted to the touching dedication. In the comments, Instagram users reacted to the Human Society's touching gesture. One person wrote, This is amazing. It was nice that us viewers of the show found a way to show our support to the Brown family in such a devastating time what an amazing legacy Garrison has. Someone else declared, This makes me so glad. Glad there is something left of Garrison's heart and his goodness. Grief is unspent love. Well, everyone spent their love on what Garrison loved. How cool is that? Garrison recently adopted his third cat. Garrison was a cat dad to three felines, Cathew, Patches, and Ms. Buttons. Less than two weeks before his death, the Sister Wives star introduced his newest family member, Ms. Buttons. She's nine years old and was on the line for euthanasia, but my savior complex couldn't suffice. Janelle Brown was brought to tears over the dedication. On March 12, before High Country Humane officially announced the news, Janelle thanked fans for their giving in honor of Garrison. However, Garrison Brown memorialized by Arizona Animal Shelter. Late Sister Wives star Garrison Brown has been memorialized by an Arizona Animal Shelter over the weekend. He was honored for his contributions and love of animals over the years. Keep reading to see the sweet moments from the event. Garrison Brown memorialized by Arizona Animal Shelter. It's been nearly three weeks since Garrison Brown took his own life. This was extremely hard for his family and all who knew him. Not only did he leave behind 17 siblings, but he also left behind his three beloved cats. He had Cathew, Patches, and the newest addition, Ms. Buttons. Ms. Buttons was about to be euthanized when Garrison rescued her just days before he passed away. Due to his devotion to his furry friends, donations started to pour in to honor him. When Janelle Brown caught wind of this, she was blown away by how generous people could be. To make it even more special, the High Country Humane and Flagstaff, Arizona decided to honor Garrison on March 23rd. Furthermore, they named their cat adoption room after him as well as his three little furry babies. According to Us Weekly, a staff member from High Country shared this during the dedication. We saw probably close to 1,000 people who supported us when we raised a little over $25,000 in just two weeks' time. It's an amazing gift in his memory and it's a true testament to the person he was. He was passionate about senior cats, and the words that people wrote in their donations were just incredibly inspiring and some of them didn't know him outside of the Sister Wives program. However, Sister Wives star Garrison Brown is honored by Animal Shelter after it was flooded with donations after 25-year-old's death. Garrison Brown has been honored by the High Country Humane Animal Shelter following his death at 25, after the center was flooded with donations in the animal lover's memory. The 25-year-old was found dead at the start of March by his brother, Gabriel Brown, with it being revealed that he had tragically taken his own life. Garrison, who was the son of Sister Wives stars Janelle and Cody Brown, had also been featured on the show along with his family and his dad's multiple wives. The young man was also a big animal lover, as was showcased on his Instagram, where he regularly shared photos of him with his rescue cats. Now, after Garrison was laid to rest, the High Country Humane Animal Shelter has revealed how they have chosen to honor his legacy by naming their cat adoption room after him in memory of his love and devotion to the unwanted animals there. The organization said in a post on social media, Today, we honor Robert Garrison Brown for his love and compassion towards cats and all animals by naming our cat adoption room after him and the cats he loved and adopted from us. Garrison, your memory has touched so many lives already and will continue to do so here at High Country Humane for years to come. 
The center also unveiled a plaque they had made in Garrison's memory, with a heartwarming photo of him with his cats, named Cathew, Patches, and Miss Buttons, which is now in the cat adoption room. The organization also shared a short video of its development director Jane Horton unveiling the plaque and revealing the huge impact Garrison had on their charity as donations came flooding in in his honor after his death. I came in at a very, very sad time, but also at a very unique situation with the passing of Garrison Brown. He was a cat lover through and through and was an adopter with us, and sadly he took his life. But through that sadness came an outpouring of love from all over the country of people wanting to give gifts in memory of Garrison. She revealed that a little over $25,000 was raised in just two weeks after Garrison's death with people sharing loving messages in his honor after having been moved by his passing. Jane added, So it's an amazing gift in his memory and it's a true testament to the person he was. She also pointed out that Garrison himself had adopted elderly cats from the shelter, seeking to give homes to those that were unwanted by others. However, Christine Brown pokes fun at David Woolley on Instagram, Is it all in good fun? Christine Brown is back on Instagram and now she's poking fun at her new husband, David Woolley. While Sister Wives fans think it's all in good fun, there are apparently some concerns about her marriage among family and friends. Christine Brown and David Woolley have been together for less than two years and have been married for less than six months. That doesn't mean they don't have habits that get under each other's skin. The Sister Wives star recently took to Instagram to poke fun at her husband, and while her loyal fans think she's being funny, some of her critics are concerned about the state of her marriage. Christine Brown recently revealed one of David Woolley's annoying habits. Sister Wives star Christine Brown is back on social media following the devastating loss of Garrison Brown. While she's discussed Garrison multiple times, she's also trying to keep things light on the platform. Recently, Christine took to Instagram to joke about how David Woolley, her husband of less than a year, parks her car. She told her fans that David loves backing her vehicle into a space to show off his impressive parking skills. The problem, however, is that he leaves no room for her to get in and out of the vehicle. Most followers could relate to the mild annoyances of married life. Some followers were a bit alarmed by the story. Christine's cute anecdote could be just that but not everyone is convinced. Several fans have noted that her need to parade her relationship out into the public so often could spell doom for them sooner rather than later. While nothing really points to cracks in their romance, they wouldn't be the first social media relationship to falter because they decided to monetize their love. Sister Wives fans have had concerns in the past. Sure, most Sister Wives fans are happy to see Christine Brown happy, but not everyone is convinced David is the man of her dreams, as she claims. Since the duo hooked up, several social media followers have expressed concerns about some of Christine's behavior. Namely, they note that the mother of six seems to be still hung up on Cody Brown. For example, she's in a brand new marriage but continues to shade her ex on social media. Some fans think she moved on quickly to prove a point, not because she found the love of her life. Fans and followers have also expressed some concerns about David, too. Sister Wives viewers have taken to Instagram and Reddit to point out some of David's less-than-desirable traits. Critics worry that Christine might have been easy to manipulate because David was aware of her life before they ever met. His daughter confirmed that he was well aware of her life and the series before they ever conversed. Reportedly, several family members aren't so sure about David Woolley. Hello, lovely viewers. Welcome to my channel. I am Sabrina, hope your day is so well. If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel.